This video is the second video of the using the research form. In this video, I will show you how to take measurements at different frequencies using your research form. First, you will find the certified quality foods icon and open it. You will be working commercial and you'll use the same login that you used um, to log into the app previously. I just misspelled certified. You log on, you would select research out of all the different supply chains, select let's get started. You can go to the profile button at the bottom and devices, confirm that your CQR is connected. If it is not, press the button on your CQR, it will blink red and then it should show that it is connected. Then go to the back arrow. This will take you back to your profile page. Hit home, then your research form. And under field one, it says enter or search for product. Here you can type in FREQ, and it gives you a choice of a frequency 10, 50, 100, or 180. Each one of these frequencies is sensitive to different types of tissue change. So if we want to measure at frequency 10, we would select frequency 10. Field two, we would put our species, maybe salmon. Field three, we could put like a tributary or site location name, but this would be a grouping name. And the field names, field one through field six, need to be filled up exactly the same each time. For example, on field three, um, you would not put site, your site ID on it the first time and then um, the length on it the next time you filled out a form. It needs to be the same thing each time. Field four, you can put in the length of the fish as a, as a number, maybe 34. Field five might be the weight of the fish, 56. Field six could be an SIN number for an individual fish if you're gonna send it to a lab for further identification so you can identify that individual fish. Under initials and comments, you can use the microphone button to leave comments. You then select take measures and your device is now ready to take a measurement um, at a frequency of 10 kilohertz. Simply press the electrodes onto the product using about the weight of your hand. If this is on a fish fillet or on a, um, on a fish, you need to do it in the same spot each time. On a whole fish, we recommend measuring just under the dorsal fin and above the lateral line. On a fillet, measure it in the middle of the fillet, going the long way of the fillet. And then using the weight of your hand as the pressure, simply press the four electrodes on there and press the button three times. It takes about a second to take a measurement. I just took three measurements and now you hit stop measuring. This gives you, now it gives you um, a synopsis of all the different measurements that you have taken. By using the back arrow, you can then go to the graphic and then it will, and then you can select sync with server. It will ask you if you have a strong internet connection, you select yes if you do, and then it will give you confirmation that your measurements have been uploaded to the server. You select okay. And then you can go back to the home page and then you can start over with a new research form and you can save that new batch. Thank you very much.